Yeah, this cell phone video you see right here was made public earlier this month. It was recorded by Sandra Bland at the time of her controversial traffic stop. It has since sparked calls from people all across the country urging investigators to reopen the case. This is video showing the incident from Bland's perspective. In the 39 second clip, you can see a trooper drawing a stun gun while ordering her to get out of the car. Bland was initially pulled over for not signaling when changing lanes. State Representative Garnett Coleman says he wants to know whether the video was with help from the family by DPS and the Texas Attorney General's office. Three days after her arrest, Bland was found dead in her cell and her death was ruled a suicide. She was only 28 years old. There was a press conference yesterday calling for the resignation of the lead investigator in the case. I had no idea that it wasn't public knowledge that we had it. I mean, in fact, we've returned the cell phone to the Bland family. Um, the prosecutors did shortly after the case was resolved back in June of 2017. They've had the cell phone that we're talking about. It's in their possession. My job is to make sure that we understand all the facts. And those are, just, those are statements that we don't know all the facts. Coleman, along with the House County Affairs Committee, will question DPS and the Attorney General's office later this morning. Once again, they want to know why this video was just made public four years after the incident. The hearing starts at 8 o'clock this morning. Dave.